me those drumsticks. Those drumsticks look delicious. They're not drumsticks. They're my forearms. No, those are drumsticks. The chicken drumsticks. And they look delicious. I'm gonna eat them. I said stay away from them. They are my forearms. They are not drumsticks. You're a liar. You just want to eat all the drumsticks for yourself. You bastard. The coolest reviews. The funnest shit. Nailing the fuck out of it every damn day of the week. It's Grim's Toy Show Action Inside a Figure Review. I am your host, Ebenezer Middlestorm. Drumsticks! <laughs> it's time for the review, and the review time is now! Because today we're going to be taking a look at the SmackDown Live main event ring. Motherfucker! Authentic 20 inch by 20 inch scale ring. 20 inches. Like my cock. <laughs> you can see all the figures it does not include because they're all sold separately. Except that some bitch right there. Because we get ourselves a bonus Jingle My Balls exclusive figure packed in the package. And if you press the button in the packaging butthole, looking the shit lights up. And then, what the, oh my god, <laughs> why is your pussy so wet? <laughs> Unassembled! Fuck you! We gotta put this thing together. What a waste. But Grim just grabbed this from WrestlingFigures.com where you can use discount code Grim at checkout to save 10%. The oldest and bestest code in the history of our sport. And this is the bullshit on the back of the box. You can recreate iconic main event moments. Like the time AJ Styles botched and fell off the top rope. Like the time that Samoa Joe nearly killed Seth Rollins by giving him a belly-to-butt suplex into the solid steel steps. Like the time Jeff Hardy almost died when he put Randy Abortion through a table. And the time that Kevin Blowins nearly crippled Roman Lames with a Pop-Tart powerbomb. Ooh, don't forget the time that Jinder... Jingle my balls. Nailed Dolphin Ziggler with the solid steel thunder punch. He fucking missed by a mile. <laughs> Touch the ring post to light it up. Attach flying posts to the stands and shit. Destroy the breakaway table. Look, he's putting his ass through the table. Oh my god, he's gonna give him a super kick out of the air. What the fuck? And here's the bullshit on the side of the box in case... You wanted to know all about Jingle My Balls. He's from Punjab, India. He's actually from Canada. <laughs> Finishing move, the Khaleesi. Career highlights, WWE champion and Jabba for six years. How the hell did this happen? And this is what it's supposed to look like once we put it together. It includes all this shit right here. Whoa. That's a lot of work for my ass to do. What a waste. Are you prepared to watch the box take a big shit? Here we go. Get it all out. There it is. Oh, yeah. Turd city, bitch. There we go. We got the ring apron here. The solid steel steps. A bunch of plastic pieces. The ring canvas. Oh, cool, yeah. The announce table. Oh, we are going to build the fuck out of this. And um, directions off of dorks. If you really need to read the instructions, well, probably need to read the instructions because... This looks, it's not too complicated. I don't know. I could probably put this together in about, I don't know, three or four minutes, maybe. Yeah, it doesn't look too complicated. I am a genius. All right, all right, you got me. It's a little bit harder than I thought. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. I put it together all wrong. What a waste. I'm too stupid. And not only that, but what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? Did somebody wipe their ass? With my fucking... You bitch! Who wiped their ass with my ring canvas, you cockball bastard fucks? Holy sheep shit on a shingle. People are pissed. Somebody wiped their ass with my canvas! Okay, so all said and done, it took me about 15 minutes to put it together. It wasn't a bad build. And uh, if you want to see how to put it together, uh, go watch the raw one. <laughs> it was the same shit. And then we got the Jingle My Balls figure... Two solid steel chairs, the SmackDown Live commentator table, and the 
We're all set up for fun, motherfucker! So that means we're gonna open up this Battle Pack Superstar Series 55 of Dean Asshole and Seth Trollins, and we're gonna have ourselves a little bit of match fun. We're gonna show you how it works. And you can get this set also from WrestlingFigures.com using discount code GRIM at checkout to save 10%. And then when we're done, we're gonna review the fuck out of him. First up, you can sit a son of a bitch in a solid steel seat. And then, <laughs> nail him down. And the seat might break, it might not. They're not really meant to be breakable seats, but you can bust the shit out of the seats if that's what you want to do. So watch, you sit the son of a bitch in a seat. And it's like, dude, here's another six tip with Sith Travins. I'm sitting in a seat, taking a shit. <laughs> you ever get a blowjob while you're taking a dump? It feels so good, you never know if you're coming or going. <laughs> and then we got the SmackDown Live announce table. Oh no, he's gonna put the son of a bitch through it. Burn it down! And see, it busts apart nicely. Oh, we have to talk about this. The fine folks at Mattel did not leave this shit stain on my ring apron. Apparently, I wiped my own ass with it before I opened the package. <laughs> yeah, uh, people at Mattel, they said, yeah, don't show the shit stain, and uh, don't blame it on us, blame it on yourself. So yeah, apparently I did it to myself. Bullshit, bullshit. <coughs> you can make the ring apron and the posts Light up and shit, you know, if you want to play in the dark. Nah, 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 Smackdown, da, 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 yeah. I'm on Raw, da, 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 da. And finally, if you want to do some sick wrestling figure setups, it comes with this little thing right here, speculum looking clear thing, and you can perch the figure on there so it looks like he's flying through the air with an elbow drop. Oh my god! <laughs> That's it, he's dead! One, two, three, bird it down! Fuck you! Oh my god, he's beating! Jingle my balls ass! And now comes my favorite part of the video, where we get to play with Jingle My Balls. Jingle, 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 jingle my balls. The man who used to be a Jabba, who arose to become WWE at a champion practically overnight due to steroids, is here in his very first elite figure. Kalos, Kalis. <laughs> the figure comes with a badass entrance turban that is easily removable and is made of solid steel rubber. And it has no detail on it or anything of any kind. We could pop it. It's removable, right? Yeah, there we go. There we go. Yeah, wait, what the fuck? Where the hell's the rest of his hair? What a waste. People are pissed. A lot of times I like to take the, the hats and stuff off the figures, the accessories, and wrap them around my penis. I always think that, <laughs> I always find it to be fun and humorous. So, here it is. Wearing Jinder Mahal's entrance gear is my wiener. No, it's my thumb. I'm kidding. I'm fucking around. Holy shit. <laughs> All right, here we go. This is his face. It's actually an excellent face scan. Holy hell, they captured his likeness just perfectly. You can see by his... His head just looked down on me. I'm doing this is his face. Stop moving around, motherfucker. Yeah, he's kind of missing some of his hair, but I guess his hair's grown in since they scanned him, which was probably a year and a half ago. What a waste. Here you can see his solid steel breasts. He's like, I've got breasts of steel. You want to face my breasts of steel? You will lose to my breasts of steel. Holy sheep shit on a shingle. Did you see this fucker's roided out forearms? Either that or he's been pulling the pulling the putt. He's been beating his monkey like it owes him money. What the fuck? No other figures in Mattel have. Holy shit. They almost look like they're wrong or something. All right, and speaking of Jingle My Balls, here we can see he has some sort of flower pattern above his ball bag. And he's got a cool color belt on his gray trunks. And he's got a big, whoa! Is that supposed to be like a tattoo of his asshole on the outside of his trunks? It's a big, bloody butthole right there 
on the outside of the back of his trunks, and he's like, oh, there's my big bloody butthole. <laughs> you can see his solid steel gray knee pads to go along with his solid steel bristicles. <laughs> and he's got black boots, black socks, and uh, this figure kicks ass. It, it, it goes awesome with the ring. And thank you guys so much for watching my review. And he might come at you with his solid steel breasticles and his roided out jerking off forearms. Holy shit, I can't even look at them. I want to fix them. <laughs> I got to do something about this. They, they just look like, oh my God. Oh my God, he's going to start beating his meat right here on camera. Oh no, 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 stop it. Thanks for watching the video. Click this one right here in case you missed something funny. And please like this video, leave a comment, and subscribe. Follow Mala. Nailed it.